Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. So we have the Scabs, no Diablo patch, whatever. Uh, I still have a few clips that are really cool and I wanted to share that actually have Diablo in them, but uh, a lot of those, uh, even though Diablo is like available, a lot of them don't even have Diablo. So the last patch didn't change a whole lot and that's why a lot of the builds that were good last patch are just as good this patch. Um, I think with Diablo in the picture, the mid-range builds were just a touch better because games often just lasted 12 turns. So if games just last tur uh, turn 12, uh, it's a really good idea to maybe have a worse build, but to have higher health when turn 10 and 11 comes around. Now, um, one thing that is for sure, and the numbers are in, that the worst builds back then are still the worst builds right now. And some of you guys know this very well. Uh, Light Fang Menagerie is the worst build in the game. Now, this doesn't mean it's the worst thing that you can play, um, because, well, there are like non-build builds. There are off-meta builds, as you might call them. They're like unfinished or unoptimized builds. Like if you're playing, like let's say, Dragons, and Dragons is pretty good build, but if you don't have the proper scaling engines, you're not really playing dragons, right? So it's just a bit of a guideline. Um, and with that in mind, I think that Light Fang builds are a little bit underrated. They are rated as the worst build in the game, though. So I'm not saying they're particularly good. But what I feel is that the baseline for a Light Fang Menagerie is pretty similar to the top end. And that is not true for a lot of other builds, which is why the rating systems out there on these websites might actually be a little bit misleading. It's certainly very useful information to still check these out and, you know, learn from them. But still, you always have to apply a little bit of, like, real-world experience or real Battlegrounds experience, I guess, and, and kind of skew the stats to how you see the game. So that's what I'm doing for you guys in this situation. And I also want to put to light that sometimes you can substantially exceed the power level of particular builds. Um, and usually that involves a lot of amalgadons. And with Menagerie, that is no exception. If I'm hungry, I need to eat immediately. What do I eat? That's rarely the case, but uh, I don't know. Nuts are good. Recommend the nuts. Any variety. Um, I like the plain salted peanuts. My favorite ones are from a Canadian chain called Loblaws or a Canadian pharmacy called Shoppers Drug Mart. However, if you need, not bad. No. Uh, I think Costco has some pretty decent peanuts as well, but they're like a bit oily. They have like Kirkland brand. They hit the flavor. It's like, I don't know if it's like 10 out of 10 on the flavor, but it's like a solid nine, which is very good for like some cheap shit, right? So very good flavor. They're just like really oily. Uh, the problem with that is they make you fat uh, because they're oily. Hmm. If I can maybe get a murloc or something here. Let's do it again. Perfect. Peanuts is good fat. Yes, guys, there are quality of foods and nutrients and fats. However, fatty peanuts from Costco is like 20,000 fucking calories in that thing. And it doesn't matter how good the fat is, if you eat, if you eat like three times more calories than you should be eating, you're gonna get fat, okay? Doesn't, doesn't matter how quality the food is. It's the salt. <laughs> yeah, it's the salt. <laughs> right. It's the salt. Oh wait, there's no elementals. I have the quill bores though. I think I am going to go with this here. Okay, it's for real though. Like, selling you guys on quality of anything is something you, you gotta watch out for. And Peanuts is a great example. 
Yeah, okay. Peanuts are like a pretty natural food. They're like a bean, kind of. They come, you know, from the ground. Good nutrients. Um, healthy fats, sure. Uh, if you don't have, like, blood pressure problems, salt is fine. Um, but, f like, oily fucking peanuts, the calories are insane. Like, this thing, this thing here is, like, light, lightly roasted, right? There's, like, no visible fat, and I'm, like, rolling them around, right? There's, there's no visible fat there. Like, barely any, if any, okay? It's, it have, like, a spice mix, which is why it's sticking to the thing a little bit. So this is, like, nearly zero fat roasted peanuts, okay? Per 50 grams, 310 calories, okay? This is 700 grams. That's 14 of those. So what's 14 times uh, 310? Jesus, that's like 4,000, 4,300 calories. So this here, the whole thing, is 4,300 calories. I can eat this in like 30 minutes. All right. I should not be eating 4,300 calories of anything in one day, as a matter of fact. Of anything. I'm going to have to freeze anyway, so I'm going to do this one because I get, like, maximum buffs. And I guess I'll hit that up with a hero power. My friend is a qualified nutritionist and martial arts instructor. Proper martial arts in plural, not just bloody kung fu. He says, body turns into what you uh, eat. So eating lots of peanuts means you'll get turned into a peanut. True. Fact. Uh, I used to eat almonds, uh, but uh, I had like, I've had kidney stones several times throughout my life. And those are, those are not nice. I do not recommend getting kidney stones. Uh, one of the kidney stones I had a few years ago, uh, I, like, retrieved it. We'll leave it at that. And we had it, like, sent to a lab, and the type of um, kidney stone that it was, uh, the, the buildup can be uh, increased with like almonds and like fake vitamin C shit. Yeah. So I try not to eat too many almonds. So I, I eat almonds still, but I try not to eat too many. And uh, overall that's worked out okay, I would say. Why don't we, uh, why don't we see what we get from four before we uh, nuke that. Oh, that's a nice one. Nah, fuck it. You have initiated a power play. That went well. have one meat being vegan what would it be one of my favorite things to eat before i went vegan was this like uh smoked sausage from like the romanian store yeah my dad would like oven roast that shit for like three hours yeah, there's a lot of fans of sausage in chat it's a very uh it's a very popular item
I was gonna say I've only lost the Tamsin. Well, okay. It's not bad, but I don't um I don't like it that much. Fine. Arby's slogan is we have the meats, but really Twitch chat has it. Oh, is that right? Did I try smoked sausage by Zuckerberg? I have not tried Zuckerberg smoked sausage, no. I have to tell you, the name does not sound particularly appetizing. Uh, yeah. What the fuck is that? Someone's attempting a pretty ambitious transition. Damn, no battle cries. <laughs> Minus 15! Peace! Sweet. Maybe I should, uh, yeah, try a 5 here. Good try. Let's try, uh, let's try another five here. Yep, that was, that was good too. Um, uh, mm. No! Fuck. I gotta do it. You saw that coming a mile away. Well, why didn't you speak up? I would have liked to know the future. Yeah, there's only like seven of them or some shit, so getting another one when you're holding two is pretty unlikely off one battle cry. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just getting straight nothing there. No poison for me. Triple. <laughs> so many. 
game. Uh, had a really good start, but since that start, it's been a little rough. And maybe not just a little. I'm gonna say he looked really strong, but he did lose to the ghost, so. Rip. Spectacular moves out there. You have initiated a power play. That one could be. I suppose that it could. So many shiny. Oh wait, there's not enough room for that. Well. Okay, it's a bit of a last minute play, but good enough. Our goal right now is to get more Amalgadons. really confused right now. Don't worry about it. Also, please don't panic. The fate of the world hangs in the battle make things more interesting. Not 
catch you next. That'll make things more interesting. Okay. Yeah, I'm going for the pure Amalgadon build. I lose this actually. I was a bit unlucky, but that's okay. Game goes longer this way. Should have taken that pirate. I should have taken the pirate that makes stuff golden, because if I make those Amalgadons golden, it's like uh, really easy to finish. Uh, I passed that card up though, I didn't get it after I realized. Uh, Nadina would be really good, and I'm looking for Hamul, which are both six drops. That was quite an unlucky turn, and obviously I'd buy like a Primal Fin or a Murazond, which I didn't get either. Well, he's dead. Yeah, the guy does have a chance, and against him I really should just stack as much health as possible on Murlocs. Or not. Okay, I'm gonna throw for content. Only one? Well, I guess that's fine. I won't need another one, so... Okay. Sometimes you get content, and sometimes content gets you. True. Oof. That's the, literally the worst attacks possible. Ouch. 
88. That's fair. That's fair. Literally what? <laughs> it's fine, guys. Don't worry about it. Do not worry about it. Yeah, more health on the Dawns is kind of a big deal. Who knows what that one could be a game changer. Oh, I guess that's not really any better, huh? Yeah, it's not really. Oh, actually, I should probably do this. Oh, that's good. Alright. I don't know, this might be the unthrowable game. More throw than before. Yeah, kind of. Because I was getting like plus five, plus five a turn. Well, no, overall they gained health. They gained health. That's fine, that's fine. And if I attacked first, that would have been a lot stronger. Good enough. Terrible. I won. Oh, maybe not. That's got a lot of health. Yeah, that's got a lot of health. Okay, well, I didn't die. I didn't die. It's fine. Alright, he is interesting, but I believe it will not net anything. I'm looking for Nadina. Good, actually. Let me think. We want Charlga. That's not that useful. Why don't you hire a new I know the reason that. Later, Nibs. This game was not throwable. Officially cannot be thrown, okay? Too strong. Too strong. Light Fang even gets a kill. Look at that, dude. Look at that. From zero to hero. Well, no. It was from zero to hero, back to zero. <laughs> then, and then, back to hero. Right, that was from zero to zero. <laughs>